It could be argued that one of the most important things that the human race must do is explore the galaxy, place their feet on new worlds and make them our home for future generations. So the question is, where? The general consensus is Mars, and say if we do end up there and build a civilization with cities, what would those cities be named? But maybe we're getting ahead of ourselves, is it really likely that we could end up on Mars? Mars has some great things going for it as a second home for us, it's comparatively close to Earth, a Mars Sol is around the same length as an Earth day, and there's even ice water there. Yet there are some issues, Mars is a lot colder than Earth, its gravity is weaker than Earth's, and its thin atmosphere does not filter the ultraviolet sunlight. Yet these issues are not stopping people from trying to reach the red planet. NASA are planning a round trip to Mars purely for exploration and plan to return their astronaut home. Home. Yet Mars One are planning a permanent Mars landing for 2032, and Elon Musk's SpaceX are planning a permanent landing for 2022. Whether these will happen or not is still unclear to us, but we can hypothesize on what these civilizations might be called. So how would we decide on a name for these Martian cities? Well, there's a variety of ways that we name the cities of Earth, and how could some of these naming conventions apply to the cities of Mars? One way we name cities and places on Earth is after geographical features of the places they're in. In example, the capital of Arkansas is called Little Rock, and is named after a small rock formation on the south bank of the Arkansas River. So, in line with Little Rock, the city of Mars could be called something as simple as Red Rock. But I feel that's not the most impressive name, as I imagine there's quite a few Red Rocks on Mars. We need something a bit more impressive. How about, say, the tallest volcano in our solar system, Olympus Mons? Being about two and a half times taller than Everest, I'd say it's a pretty decent geographical landmark. The city could be named after the volcano directly, or traditional suffix could be added on. Who wouldn't want to live at Olympus Polis? Another way cities are named on Earth is by being named after their founders. St. Petersburg is named after its founder, Tsar Peter the Great. Rome is supposedly named after its legendary founder and first King Romulus. And of course, Springfield is named after Jebediah Springfield. So how could this apply to Mars? Well, we'd have to figure out who could be the founder of a city of Mars. As previously mentioned, SpaceX are trying to colonize the planet. So this city could be named after our PayPal Lord and Savior slash real life supervillain Elon Musk or even after the founders of Mars One, Baz Landsdrop and Arno Villiders. Aside from founders, cities can be named after people who are important to that city. Dallas, Texas was named after George M. Dallas, the former US Vice President, and places in Britain like St. Albans, St. Andrews and St. David's were all named after their respective saints. A city on Mars could be named after people important to the history of Mars. Unlike Pluto or Neptune, no single person directly discovered Mars, as it's visible from Earth with the human eye. So while a city on Mars can't be named after a discoverer, people like Christian Huygens, who discovered Certus Major on the planet, which was the first ever documented surface feature on another planet, could be the namesake of a city there. While no astronaut has yet set foot on Mars, NASA are always training up new astronauts, the latest group of them being selected in June of 2017 preparing for training. Perhaps it could be one of these people to be the first person to set foot on the red planet, leading to its city being named after one of them. Or it could be named after someone or something important to space exploration as a whole. The city could be named after the likes of Yuri Gagarin, the first person in space, or Neil Armstrong, the first person on the moon. We could even move away from naming after a human and name it out of respect to one of history's space animals. I'd love to live in a city named out of respect to like a space dog. And if you wanted to take more of a pop culture route with the naming of the city, it could even be named in Ode of David Bowie thanks to his song Life on Mars. Honestly, I just wanted to mention it as it's probably my favourite song ever. How about if the city of Mars takes the new approach, in the same vein as New York or New Orleans, but what could a city on Mars be the new version of? Perhaps the city could be named after the Curiosity rover, with the city being called New Curiosity. I know it might seem a bit ridiculous, but the work it has done and the personality NASA has given the machine has made the rover so lovable and something of a cultural icon, and more importantly, giving people a fun and accessible way to learn about Mars. And as someone who strives to make learning more fun and accessible, I personally think it would be awesome if the first city on Mars was named after this real life Wally, and it really could be the newer version of the Curiosity. Curiosity rover, go from a single machine studying Mars to a whole civilization studying it. But yes, I know, physical locations that start with a new are normally named after already established physical locations, and the Curiosity rover is not one of those. Whoever creates the first city on Mars, they could make a huge statement by calling the city New Earth, or just New Home. That sounds a lot less intimidating. Of course, these are all just ideas, ideas based on facts. 
the fact being the naming conventions of cities and places on Earth and applying those facts to a city on Mars. It could very well be none of these ideas. Not every city on Earth fits into one of these conventions. Perhaps the founder of a city on Mars will invent a whole new word. Perhaps the Martians have already named it. Or perhaps it will go to a public poll and the city will be called Marzy McMarsface.